And new tonight, France was the topic of conversation at a pro-Israel rally in South Florida. Republican presidential candidate Marco Rubio and other local politicians took the opportunity to condemn the tax in Paris. NBC6 reporter Laura Rodriguez is live in Miami Beach now with his full message. Laura? Well, Keith, this event just wrapped up here moments ago, and Senator Rubio was welcomed with lots of applause, lots of support when he took the stage here right behind me and addressed the Jewish community. He began his speech saying the attacks in Paris are a reminder that evil is alive and well in the world. In a statement released yesterday, he also called the attacks a wake-up call and described it as a clash of civilizations. Rubio, Senator Bill Nelson, Congressman Mario diaz Velarte, and other local leaders condemned hatred and anti-Semitism. The theme of the event was never again. It was a rally against anti-Semitism and the campaign against Israel's right to exist. The rally, the rally was planned before the terrorist attacks in Paris took place, but everyone present stood together and even held a moment of silence to honor the citizens of France. Now let's listen into how Senator Rubio concluded his speech moments ago. We were reminded this week that evil, unfortunately, is alive and well in the world just this Friday. And we are reminded that we are still called to be vigilant and to defeat it in every form that it takes. It changes names, it changes locations, but it is evil nonetheless. And the Consul General of France was also present here at the rally, but he did not make any remarks. And when Jewish leaders began the rally, they told the Consul General of France to make sure to send a message to the French people that the people of Miami stand with them. Reporting live in Miami Beach, Laura Rodriguez, NBC6 News.